Welcome everyone to the first Belmont Volleyball Varsity game. It's Belmont playing, I'm pretty sure, Watertown. Um, it's our home opener, first game in our uh, stadium. We just watched the JV play their game in a decisive three to zero win. And now we're hoping the same is for varsity. First serve for Belmont is by Yuval. It's a strong serve. But Watertown gets it back over. A good right side hit, but it's just out of bounds, giving Watertown the point. Number seven for Watertown serving. A strong float serve. And a good roll shot from number 14. Second person serving for Belmont, number 10, Sophia. It's a good serve deep in the back of the court. Watertown struggling to get it back over and they do not. Bringing the score three to one, Belmont. Second serve for Sophia. Another strong serve and it's an ace. Beautiful serve. The third serve just out of bounds on the left side of the court. Giving Watertown the serve, bringing the score four to two. A good receive from number two. And a nice tip ball. Belmont has the serve, number 14, Uwe. A really strong serve. Watertown did not have a chance of getting that up. Let's see if, how many of these she can do. It's got a really powerful hit. Another strong serve. Watertown gets it up, frees it over the net. Belmont sets up for a right side attack. A strong hit, but it's outside. Giving Watertown the point. Watertown making some substitutions here. Number 30 serving for Watertown. A float serve. Belmont sets up an outside shot. Watertown gets it back up, but doesn't play it. It's not something you want to do. Got you for the serve for Belmont. Another really powerful serve. Belmont seems to be excelling in that. It'll help them later in the match. Get a good lead. Right now we're up by five.
Watertown gets it up. Back to Belmont. A right side hit, really strong, but out of bounds in the back of the court. Number six serving for Watertown. A middle hit right in the middle. No one was there. What a hit. Number 11, Wenchy, serving for Belmont, one of our captains, and gets an ace. What a, what a serve. Our captains this year are number 11, Wenchy, and number 7, Gabby. Just a little out of bounds. The score coming up to 10 to 6. 10 to 5, sorry. 31 for Watertown serving. Belmont gets it back up. Just out of bounds. Served by Watertown. Belmont sets out up an outside shot, goes into the net. Score is 10 to 7. And Belmont gets a great middle hit. It was, it was tipped off the Watertown girl. Number seven, Gabby, one of our other captains serving for Belmont. Watertown gets it up but doesn't manage to control it, giving Belmont the, the point. Second serve for Gabby. Another really strong serve. This one is an ace. What a serve. Watertown not able to get their hands securely on that ball. Let's make this three in a row. And she does. What a serve. Got a number of really strong hitters and servers on this team. And Gabby is leading them. Timeout called by Watertown. Very, very good for Belmont. Intimidated by Gabby's serves. The starting lineup for Belmont, uh, number 14, Rui, number 10, Sophia, number 8, Sadie, number 12, Katya, number 11, Wenshi, and number 7, Gabby. It's a very strong lineup out here, and the score is definitely reflecting that. And she keeps it up after that long timeout. She is able to get her serve, keep it back. 
Let's see how many she can do in a row. This is gonna be good. Another one. And another one Watertown struggles to keep onto and they don't. The score is now 16 to seven, Belmont. serve and is just out of bounds after the refs are questionable about that call. A really strong serve by Gabby, a nice long run. Some confusion about the ball. The libero for Watertown serving. Belmont sets it up perfectly. Outside hit, a strong one, blocked by Watertown. That was a really strong block. And Belmont's unable to get it back up. Number one for Watertown serving again. And it's a high serve over the net. Gives Belmont another chance. And the call was two, two touches for Watertown. They didn't manage to set it nicely. So one person touched it two times in a row, which is illegal. Serve for Belmont. Watertown not able to set it nicely, but gets it over the net. A right side hit for Belmont. A tip over the net. Another tip, tried to get it over the net, but just short. And the call was four touches because we weren't able to get it over the net. Number seven for Watertown serving. Belmont sets up a middle hit out the back. Belmont in serve, receive. And an outside hit, a really strong one gets past the libero, down on the ground. Those are the types of hits we like to see here. And they're really common. Very strong hits from Belmont. Serve. And Watertown shanks it away. Belmont is leading the game 19 to 11 in this first set. Sophia has the serve. Good serve over the net. Watertown frees it over, a miscommunication by Belmont. Not, no one there to get it. A really strong serve, low over the net, hard to, hard to put back up for Belmont. Watertown aces it against Belmont. Another good serve, Belmont gets it, sets it up, hits it into the net. What they gotta do there is just shake it off, get the next point. Still got a solid lead, 19 to 14. Sets up a right side hit. Barely gets it over the net, and that does it. Sometimes it's the little, little things that count. Number 14, Uwe serving for Belmont. 
and a substitution made. Number nine, June, coming in for our captain, Gabby. Wow, what a serve. And a back row free ball over for Belmont. Can we capitalize on this? Almost. A funky hit from Watertown gives Belmont the chance to take it. Watertown gets it back over. Belmont tries to free it over. Doesn't manage to get it in the court. Watertown gets that point. One of the longest points we've had this game. Solid effort from both teams. Watertown serving. Belmont receives. Tips it over. It hits the antenna, which is as good as going out. If it hits the antenna and comes back in the court, it's still counted as out. Serve from Watertown. Tipped over. Watertown unable to get it up. No one was in that middle area of the court. It makes it really difficult to receive a nice ball. Number 12, Katya serving for Belmont. Watertown is able to get it up, isn't able to capitalize, frees it over for Belmont. A strong hit by June. Another free ball from Watertown. We've been seeing a lot of those. A right side hit and hits it straight at her. Watertown unable to get it back. Another serve for Belmont. 22 to 16, three more points to win this set. A good serve in the back of the court. Watertown thought it was out, called it out, didn't, didn't go for it, and the refs called it in. Another serve, this one a miscommunication Two people thought the other person were going for it. It really is disappointing when that happens. Just got to talk on the court. Clears up any miscommunications you might have. Serve for Belmont. Short serve, libero digs it, gets it. They don't get it over and that wins the set for Belmont. Bringing the total one to zero Belmont. Going into the Second, a really strong first set, a lot of good serves as I've mentioned, a good number of hits, not too many free balls which is good for us, a lot of free balls from Watertown which is also good for us. See you in the second. Welcome back, we're in the second set. Score is now zero to zero. Belmont needs to win two more of these for a total of three. Varsity game plays best out of five. First person to three games wins. And the fifth set goes to 15 instead of 25. Belmont's playing a really solid game so far. Now it's just waiting on the refs to get set up. Everyone's on the court. Belmont serving first. And we're gonna try and keep up this game play. Slight hiccup. 
moving back the camera so it doesn't get in the way. Serve from Belmont. Come out strong, a good first serve. Watertown frees it over. A middle hit, a really good middle hit. Watertown unable to get it back up. One to zero for Belmont. Another serve, a short serve. Watertown wasn't expecting that. They were back in the back of the court, ready for that really strong, deep serve. I don't think Gabby was expecting that either. We'll see what she does here. Now this one is a deep ball. Watertown hits it over, first time in a while. Belmont frees it over. The refs have a difficult decision. They decide that we were under the net when we hit, which gives the point to Watertown. We can't step over that middle maroon line. It's dangerous for both teams, so it's illegal. Watertown with the serve. A really strong serve. Belmont thought us out. It was not, it was on the line. It was close. Those points really disappointing when they happen. Just gotta shake it off. Now this one's a float serve. A good hit by Belmont. Watertown, freeze it over. A strong free though, wasn't. Another good hit. Nowhere, no one was there. Libero tries to get it. Doesn't get it up. Not there in time. Belmont gets the point. Yuval with the serve. Zulal. And Watertown, another miscommunication by them. You really gotta minimize those miscommunications. All you gotta do is talk on the court. Easier said than done, but still. Another good, good serve. Score is five to two. Another good serve. Watertown needs to decide if they're gonna play that ball or not. If they don't, it's just free points for Belmont. Another good serve. Watertown frees it over on the second. Belmont with a really good hit. I will say Watertown is very good at keeping, at keeping that play going. Not so good at getting good strong hits as Belmont is, which is good for Belmont. They're really capitalizing on that. Another serve. Watertown frees it over. Belmont mishits it. A little laughing on the court. Spirits are light. First serve for Watertown in a while. And there's one of those miscommunications. For Belmont, we don't see that often. But when they do, it doesn't, doesn't work out that well. Serve from Watertown. An outside hip. Out of bounds. It's a little too high for Belmont. Need to keep those hits low, close to the net. A 
A free ball from Belmont over the net, wasn't able to set it up. Watertown unable to capitalize on it though, they hit it into the net instead of over it. Sophia, number 10, serving for Belmont. And a substitution made. Number nine in, number seven out. Some talking from the Belmont coach and the players on the court and the refs to each other. Not sure what it's about, but we're gonna play on. Sorry for Belmont. Ooh, <laughs> we get it over the net. Watertown player hits it into the other girl's face. Ow. A serve over the net. A good dig by Watertown and a really strong middle hit from Watertown. Belmont setting up. A good, good block from Watertown. Another set, set up shot from Belmont. Watertown gets it over. Sophia with the set. A nice shot from Belmont, placing it perfectly where no one was. Those hard hits are good, but when you can, figuring out a place to put it, just throwing it there is, works really well. Watertown sets up a hit. Belmont gets it back. Ooh, I saw I was touching that, but the refs did not. And Watertown hits it into the net, trying to free it over. Score is 11 to five Belmont. Really good sign for the game. And we get it over the net. Oh, a really nice dig from Wenshi. Was ready for that. And we set up Wenshi for a hit. Let's see if Watertown can get this back over. They cannot. That was a really good point for Belmont. It's good communication. Good reflexes by the team. That dig was perfect. Serve for Belmont. Another good serve. We're seeing that a lot this year. Serve, Libero gets it up. And a middle hit from Belmont. A good middle hit. Unable to get it back over. Serve from Watertown. And the refs called a out of rotation for Belmont. I'm pretty sure is what I saw. There's a certain rotation you have to be in and if, if one person is farther left on the court when they're supposed to be right, the refs call that and give the point to the other team. Belmont with the hit. And Watertown frees it over, I'd say. Good outside hit. Belmont setting up that outside, that right side shot. Watertown is tipping it over now. Step up from their free balls earlier. That one was an interesting free ball, it worked well. It's a long point. Belmont sets up a really good middle shot Watertown is able to get it back, freeing it. A really strong free, but outside the court. A low to the net, which is what you want to do, but when you're freeing it over, you don't have that much of a option, really. 
and the substitution in. Number five, Aaron Daly's serving for Belmont. Substitutions made by Watertown also. Float serve. Lavero unable to get there. Those float ser serves are really hard to read when they're coming over at you at high speeds. Another good serve. And Watertown, mm, miscommunication by Watertown. They were going to try and free it over, but two people thought they were, the other person was going for it and just let it drop to the ground. Third serve for, for Belmont. Scores 16 to 7. And a free ball over from Watertown. Right to Sophia for a, for a hit. It's out of bounds. A really good setup. Sophia setting to June for the hit. Belmont's created a really good large lead here, 16 to 8. Watertown serves it over. Sophia with the back set, a really good back set, really strong hit too by Wenshi. And it hits, it hits number 7 on Watertown and goes out of bounds. Katia serving for Belmont. Watertown gets it up. Mm, some not so good passes, unable to get it back over to Belmont. And Watertown takes another timeout. Watertown having one timeout in the first set and one timeout in the second set. Belmont with a 10 point lead. If we keep it up like this, we'll have this game over and done with in three sets. Belmont back out on the court. Playing well, not having to adjust much. Watertown taking longer, trying to readjust their game so they can come back. But a 10 point lead is really hard to come back from. Belmont waiting, Watertown talking. This is Belmont's home opener of, of this 2024 season. We've had a lot of, lot of sports games this week, home openers. Belmont to close it out. Watertown sets it over. Belmont, the right side shot, low to the net. Watertown unable to set up their attack. Pass it over the net, but out. Giving Belmont the point. Serve from Belmont. Oh, oh. Was unexpected, I was, I was looking for the hit. I was looking for the serve, said I went for the hit instead, hit it over and in. Watertown serve. Went she for the hit. Mm, just out of bounds. The Watertown player ducked <laughs> as to not touch it. Read that ball well, knew it was going out of bounds. Number six serving. Watertown, an outside shot in the back of the court. Number nine, June, a really strong hit from number nine. 
Love to see it. Captain when she's serving. And serves it in for the ace. Watertown going for it, touches it, doesn't get it up. Four more points for the game two. Another ace. Two in a row. Let's make it three. 22 to 10. And she made it three. Oh my lord. Two more points. Watertown having trouble reading her serves. They need to set up some attacks here. That, from my point of view, that looked in, but can't go against the refs. They called it out. Watertown surf. Number 31 serving. It's short, is too short. Hits the net. Gives the point to Belmont. Just one more point, and then we go to game three. It's been a great two sets. Number nine. June serving for Belmont. Hits it over. Watertown unable to set up the attack there. Belmont is, goes for the outside shot. Watertown frees it over, mm, and a miscommunication by Belmont. So close to the net, hard, hard to get there for the back row. Watertown serving, number one. Belmont sets it up. Strong attack. Watertown with the block, though. Watertown finally setting up an attack. A really good attack in it. They get the point. When they can, those strong attacks are really hard, hard to get. Watertown serving it over. Belmont trying to finish out this game. They've got a solid lead, no pressure here. There is for Watertown though, and they seem to be excelling in it, having scored three points in a row. Belmont just needs one more point. And Watertown is a, has a serve over. Belmont tips it. It tips it into the net. And that is the game. Coming two to zero, Belmont winning. Let's see if they can do it in game three. And for game three and the rest of the game, we're gonna have Royce and Thomas commentating. I'll see you then, or they will. Welcome back everyone. My name is Royce Pang and I'm joined by fellow, fellow partner, Thomas Burkowski. Thomas, how are you doing today? I'm all right, how about you? I'm doing perfectly fine on this fr Friday afternoon. Uh, quick thank you to uh, Becca for let, um, handing it off to yep. us and we, uh, thank her for doing a good job on commentating. Yeah, before. she did an amazing job. That's what I heard. We seem to have some new players on the court. I see Nir, Nir Singh. Nir Singh. Uh, that that's my favorite photographer. <laughs> Please look at Le Nir Singh. Oh, Nir Singh. Oh, Nir Singh.
Uh, shout out Nir Singh real quick. Yeah. Um, maybe hope maybe you can find his Instagram. I just I don't know the handle, but Nir Singh helps take photos for all the Belmont sports teams, and uh, you can actually go check BHS Sports TV on Instagram, and you'll see that together yeah. we collaborate to post some pictures of your Belmont athletes. Yep. Very. I would say very nice pictures. Don't you think so yourself? Definitely, definitely. I've definitely posted a few, used a few. <laughs> oh, and quick ad for Nir Singh. He is taking senior portraits. Yep, he is. Senior portraits. Come and get them from Nir Singh. <laughs> well, it's one-to-one -one so far. Belmont is up for serve in their third set. Let's see if Belmont can seal the deal. Balls up. And ace. Yep. Belmont is up for serve again, and let's see where it goes. Serve is up. And it appears to be a rotation issue for Belmont, so that is Watertown's points. Score is tied 2-2. Watertown up for serve, number seven up for serve now. Definitely some changes from last year's Belmont team. Uh, we did lose a couple of Good seniors. Great. I would say great. Sonia, Bella. I apologize if I forgot anybody <laughs> else. <laughs> um, but definitely a very strong senior class that graduated last year. But and also, we yep. wish the best for this upcoming new team. Yes, right? yes, of course. Especially in any freshmen or sophomores, or even juniors, oh, that yeah. are new to the team. Esther is up for serve now. Let's see if she can get this ace. And it's up. Nice hit. And Watertown. Gets it across, and that is Watertown's course. points. Watertown super excited for that. Score is tied 3-3. We do see um, Gabby in a new jersey from last year. She used to wear the white um, signifying her as the libero position. It seems that she's playing in the back row, number seven. Good hit by Wenchi. And, and that is in. Belmont's points. Belmont up four to three now. And there's a substitution for Watertown. Angela coming in for Gabby. Ref's talking with the scores table. And scores table, you can actually see Larry, I uh -huh, think, right? Uh -huh. Larry, um, I think he's captain of the boys' volleyball team next I year, I believe right? so. Yep, I think oh. so. And that is Watertown's points. There also seems to be Jackie, also <laughs> a player for Belmont Boys Volleyball. Newly created team, so in the spring, be sure to come check them out. Hopefully. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, Watertown They do seem to be having a a coaching problem right now. Oh, that is true. Any parents listening, I mean, the coaching position, I think it's up for grabs. The position is always up. Uh, Sadie, number eight, uh, coming in. Belmont's up for serve. Watertown receives it, and that is Belmont's points. I wonder why they got rid of their A celebration. Yeah, I wonder why. Yeah, I, I, I liked it. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I the, actually remember um, Larry Zank, um, yeah, 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 JV yeah, yeah. season. Uh -huh, he always uh -huh. loved to do that. Um, that's what I'm saying. I just... So, good things can't stay. Yep. Unfortunately, it has it to come to an end. Is. Belmont's up. And no Another communication. Ace. No communication from Watertown. That is Belmont's points. Number Score, 15 getting hot. Score is 7-4 to four with Belmont in the lead. Serve is up. Watertown receives it. Set up. And free ball. Belmont receives it now. Going to the outside to Wenshi. And that is Big Belmont. Hit. I believe Wenshi is playing opposite hitter right now. I'm like that. I got that volleyball <laughs> IQ. <laughs> mess with me. 
<laughs> I've been studying, doing my research. I'm ready. So Thomas, are you joining boys volleyball next year then? Does that, uh, seem like, does that seem like it's the case? I'm actually, I got offers from Belmont Frisbee. <laughs> <laughs> Belmont track from my soccer JV coach <laughs> and, and Belmont boys volleyball. So, so, and just doing nothing. Yeah, so. We're just waiting for you to commit. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll get the hat and everything. Watertown. Free ball again. Rui receives it. Right to the outside to Angelo. Watertown receives it again and tries to get it over. Gets it to Wenshi, and that is Belmont's points. Belmont seem to be enjoying themselves, which is... I think they're on a 5-0 lead right now, 5-0 run. Yeah, 15 for Belmont, still serving the ball. Score is 10-4, and serve is up. Received by Watertown, and Watertown with a... Little mistake over there. Oh, there is a celebration. I missed it, but <laughs> Belmont seems to be doing the Wii bowling pin celebration. <laughs> Alright, nice to see that. So they got they got something to something to do. Quick little timeout. As we know, it's common that so many Belmont athletes catch fire, so other teams just they just have to ice us. They just know? have to they, have, yep. they they got no other choice. It's a tactical strategy, but Unfortunate to see the icing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Must be done though. Yep. We can see the stands are pretty packed today. If you, if I say so myself. Yep. Yep. I think I saw Mark Gazzolian somewhere. Where did Mark Gazzolian go? Mr. President Mr. and VP are both here. Mark Azolian, class president of 2025, NHS mm -hmm, president mm -hmm. as well. Um, what other accolades does he have? Oh, Celtics ball Celtics. knowledge. Yep, Celtics Super. legend. Yep, yep, yep. That is 12 to 4, Belmont in the lead. Belmont now tripling Watertown score. Number 15 is on a 7-0 run right now. See if we can make the lead greater. Watertown, up. Get it over. Umi gets it. Esther. And Watertown, number seven sets it over. Again. Umi with the set, right to Wenshi. And that is Belmont's points. And the crowd is loving it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They're doing the wave already? Yup. Yo, why can't we know soccer doesn't get this? <laughs> I, mean, I know uh, any other sport doesn't <laughs> get this. Uh. Serve is up. Watertown receives. Right to the outside. Received by Belmont. Bit far. Belmont still recovers. And, and they get it over. puts it over. Esther with the serve. Not the best, but it's still up. We got a good rally on our hands. The set is up, and there's the hit. And that is Belmont. Nice and controlled spike from Angela, just finding the open space. And now we are 14 to four. Looks like Belmont is running with the game already, running away with the game. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Can Watertown come back? Probably not, but here we go. <laughs> Watertown gets it over. Right to Belmont. Sets it up. There's the tip. Oh. And Watertown just can't seem to get the ball over. Lead is so, so grand, I would say, right now that Nier Singh has stopped taking photos, I see. Also partially because this camera is dead. But, yeah, yeah. But yeah. we don't address that fact. No, no, no. Esther with the set to the outside. Angela. And no communication by Watertown. They look defeated right now. Mm. Couple words being spoken with the Watertown players with Watertown's coach. 
Belmont definitely like, showcasing their energy here. 15 to serve, maybe an ace. And there's the serve. Oh. Water time gets it though. Let's see if they can get it over. And they do. Received by Sadie. Up to Angela. Ooh. And that uh. is Water Towns. That looks like Belmont to me. I don't know. I don't know. We're, we're a bit of a weird angle, but it, look, it, it, was, it was nice. It was nice, but it is what it is. Water Town breaking that. What was that? <laughs> Uh, it was a pretty big lead. A, a big too a little, a lot too a little. And the Belmont bench is celebrating right now, as they should. This will be a nice, clean sweep after losing two to three against Melrose away. And that should be out. And, and that Belmont is Belmont's. Point. Should be celebrating. Mm -hmm. First week, um, end of first week. It's a Friday. Um, SCT scores came out. Mm -hmm. Fortunately, unfortunately, I didn't do so good. How about you, Thomas? Mm -hmm. Let's focus on the volleyball game. Yeah. <laughs> Gabby, number seven, captain up for serve. Uh, what, oh, 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 oh. I didn't expect that, but same thing. Captain Wenchie up for serve. There you go. Ready? And, oh, wait, what's wait, happening now? We're going to add some suspense. I think that's also a tactic. The refs are icing the Belmont players. Yeah, yeah, this, don't you this think this so? This oh, we actually, I don't know if we can talk about the refs badly. We might get fined. That's true, that's yeah, true. Yeah, we got to watch out. We got to keep Olé! it on ah. Great serve, just not in the box. That is Watertown. Watertown, substitution right now. And Watertown should be up for serve. Serve is up. Who was that? Ui with the receive. Right to Gabby. Gabby gets it over. Watertown. Watertown. Just couldn't react fast enough. Yep. Seems like they lost all their energy. I mean, volleyball, definitely a tiring game. Jumping nonstop for... I don't know. I would have died for that. You think so? Yeah, me too. Yep. No, nah, I don't like diving. I'm, I oh. think I stay on my feet. You know, oh. it's just not. It's just not. I can't play this sport. I think. You know what? I think I have to cross that volleyball. You know, <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's meant for me. Gets it over. Watertown receives. Maybe a block. Oh. And almost, but that is Watertown's points. Watertown is slowly starting to shorten, reduce the lead. Belmont don't seem to be too stressed about giving up a point. Well, it's 18 to 7. It know. is 18 to 7. In basketball terms, what would you say that is? I don't know. That's a pretty big lead. That looks like a 15, 20 point lead right 15, there. 15, 20 point lead? Yeah, I don't like the sounds of that. Mm, so, all right, let's do basketball. I think that's like a 30 to 12. <laughs> 30 to 12? Yeah, that's good enough. Oh! And a nice one. Nice hit by Ui. Holy we did not see that holy coming. Holy Umi. And somehow the Watertown players are getting excited now. Oh, she ain't even celebrated though. <laughs> it's, just, it's just an everyday spike for her. <laughs> and there's five players on the court right now. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Sadie is up for serve right now. Scores 19 to seven, Belmont with the lead. Oh, what's happening right now? I didn't study that. Uh, whatever. Stadium with the serve. Watertown oh. with the dig. Serve. Uh, Gets it over. Go Watertown went for the dunk, but now SC right sets it. It's tipped over. And Watertown gets it another over. Another dunk. Ooh, he gets Wee. it over. Watertown going for it. And that is Belmont's points. Great. Great adjusting by Umi. Great dig by Gabby, actually. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's the diving I was talking about. That's the diving that Watertown does not effort. have. That's the effort. That's that championship mentality. Every point matters. That's that. Watertown can't seem to get it over. And what uh, Belmont needs four more points, and they will be... Five, four, four, yeah, four more points. <laughs> and they'll win. And then Belmont <laughs> takes the win. Nice and controlled, easy win, nothing too much. Good rotation. Players Good home game, minutes. yep. Season opener. Season opener, GP something like. And Esther okay. seems to have touched the net. Unfortunate. <sighs> we have to expect better, but. Yep, come on. 
<laughs> Mistakes happen though. Water down up for serve. And doesn't get it over. That is Belmont points. Do we know how um perhaps uh, JV did or um I'm actually not sure. Uh, I'm gonna have to ask the JV players for that, but we'll see tomorrow. Ole! Good oh. serve by Esther. Watertown confusion, and, and it's an ace. And that's it's kind of stab padding in my opinion. If I'll be honest. <laughs> <laughs> but it's okay. An ace is an ace. Point is a point. And it's Belmont's ball. Esther to serve up again. Serve is up. Watertown receives. I want to see. You know what I'm trying to see, Royce? What? A, a monster block. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm Unfortunately, trying. there's two more points. I don't think that's happening this game. All right towards the outside. Ooh. And a nice hit by Wenji. All right towards Watertown, though. Oh, miscommunication there. But Ui gets it over. And that is oh, Belmont's wow. points again. It's just too easy. It's just too easy for her. Esther to serve up once more. Can she end the game with an ace? It is match point right now, 24 to 8. That Belmont was, can that seal was, the deal right yep, now. Yep, uh huh. All right, silence. And, and there's the over. game. GG's. <laughs> well played by Belmont. And that is Belmont's home opener. Um, Belmont won 3 to 0. Mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. yeah, hopefully we can see, see you next time. Yep. Thank you, everyone. Thank you.